Hey loves and welcome back to my channel. Thank you for joining me again tonight on What's For Dinner Wednesdays. Tonight is something very simple, something easy, something nutritious. It will be rice and beans with some veggies in it of course with a side of broccoli. Um, again, I think it took me maybe hour and a half. So most of it is prep. So prep your food, prep your food, prep your food if you don't want to be in the kitchen all day. So, um, I didn't prep. So I've been in the kitchen all evening. But no, so um, this is a very delicious meal. I believe you'll enjoy it. So um, if you make it, let me know. This is a Pinterest inspired meal. So I will put the link below of the um, inspiration as to where I got this from. As far as the ingredients I use, I do try to use some of my own things and for flavor for me and my family we did add a little bit of salt and pepper to it at the end just to give it a little bit more flavor but yeah so i hope you guys enjoy okay, so we've got some bell peppers and i'm going to use the mini ones and just chop them up because hey all bell peppers work and that's what i had um we've got a sweet onion and some minced garlic that's going to go into this mix um we got some crushed to i'm sorry diced tomatoes and then we're going to do two cans of black beans, um, crushed red peppers, some cumin, and then some cilantro. And like I tell you guys, we're gonna add a little salt and pepper at the end just to give a little flavor. Um, to that mix, as we get that cooking, I'm gonna add in some brown rice. And I've already rinsed that rice and made it um, clean, made sure it was clean. And then we've got in the pan already, I've added the onions and sauteed them, and then the bell peppers are in here as well. Then I've added here now the cumin and the red pepper flakes and the garlic. And I'm just mixing that up just a little bit to get it to cook and um, blend in and get the flavors all mixed in. Be careful because this mixture does make you sneeze. So just a word to the wise. Be careful. All right, so I'm going to mix this all up, get it all going. And then I'm going to go in and add in the diced tomatoes. Um, and then I'm going to let that cook down for just a little bit. So as I add in the diced tomatoes, it's going to um, blend in the flavors that I've already mixed in with the onions and bell peppers. I'm going to let that cook for a couple minutes and to mix itself in and get all nice and marinated together um, before I decide to add in the next portion of that. So that cooks for about a minute or so. And then we come back and we're going to add in um, the brown rice and the veggie broth once that's all said and done so it looks yummy all blended in together i know it's just tomatoes but hey so now i'm going to add the brown rice and it is rinsed y'all know i'm getting the rest of that rice out right so i'm going to get my scraper scrape it on in there now i'm going to add in the veggie broth i'm going to put this whole thing in there because um it calls for it. Again, the recipe link will be in the description box for you. So if you have questions, definitely, definitely, definitely refer to the recipe because it is helpful. It is beneficial and it will help you. You know, do like I do and make it your own after you've already um, gotten an idea of how they do it and how I did it. Now you can go back and make it your own because, you know, that's what cooks do. We follow a recipe and then we tweak it to our liking so that way we have something that we can refer back to when we're ready to make it again and we don't have to just always go to the recipe. So, but this is the mixture. Um, getting it all mixed together, getting the rice all mixed together. And I'm going to bring it to a boil. And as it comes to a boil, then that's when I'm going to be able to turn it down and let it simmer for about 45 minutes. So I'm going to put that lid on that and let it simmer for 45 minutes. Okay, It is all done cooking. It's been about 45 minutes. Look at all this steam and smoke. Sorry, y'all. So this is what we have. Now, as I look at it and get it all mixed together, look at that, y'all. Mm, mm, mm. Looks so good. I can't wait. Can't wait to taste it. I'm going to add in my black beans. I did rinse them off, even though they were organic. I just rinse off canned beans because I just rinse off canned beans. Um, so I rinse them off and added them in. And then I'm going to add in the cilantro. I did go with dried cilantro only because I didn't want to buy a bunch of fresh cilantro and then not go back to reuse it. So I went with the dried cilantro 
and added it into the mixture and got it all mixed together. And it still tastes just amazing to me. I mean, if you prefer fresh, do fresh. If you're okay with dry, do dry. But this is the rice and bean um, meal that we created. And we're going to pair it with a side of broccoli and go from there. But that's it. Hope you guys enjoyed it. All right. So here is the finished plate. Looking amazing. Love it, love it, love it, love it, love it. So um, you guys try it. Let me know what you think. Thank you guys so much for watching. Hope you enjoy. And tis the season. Yes, we've got our tree up. Um, the kids decorated it. So we are ready to go to get the holidays going. So hope you guys enjoy. Um, be blessed and less stressed because Chauncey speaks. Bye.